iron in the soul. What's up, YouTube? This is your big brother, King Jabez. Back today with another very important message. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, share this video, leave a comment, let me know what you think about my content. In addition to that, please feel free to follow me over on Instagram at the King Jabez, as well as my website, theironsoul.com. Whatever you decide to do, it will be greatly appreciated. I have a very important message for you today. Today's video is entitled, You Are About to Blow Up. You Must Guard what makes you attractive listen to what i say today listen to this message very carefully you're about to blow up your time is here your moment is here your opportunity is here to open doors remember i said in a previous video 2024 is the year of open doors so as that happens you have to guard you have to protect you have to shield that which makes you attractive and for all of us it'll be something different once again, for some of you, it may be your looks. For others, it may be a musical ability, talent with sports. You have the ability to influence people. You have charisma. Whatever it is about you that attracts people to you, and that brings opportunity, that brings open doors, that's the very place where you'll be attacked the most. And it's your responsibility to guard that. This may mean cutting same, certain people off, your attraction is uniquely wired by the Most High Himself. From the shade of your skin, your shape, your physique for men, the height you are, the skills you have, your ability to do music, your ability to create art, those who have business skills, entrepreneurs, those of you who are great communicators, whatever the skill and ability and look and presence and aura may be, you are in a place now where it's time to put on the finishing polish. And sometimes it may be very practical, such as consistently going to the gym five, six times a week, drinking your gallon of water, your diet, your rest. And there's something else I want to talk about today that can help you with gardening attraction. And it's something I believe all of us should do on a consistent basis, day by day, not just for a few days, over the course of six months to a year to really get that glow. And this is why I'm excited today to announce today's sponsor for this video. Today's sponsor for this video is Teach Hanley. Teach Hanley simplifies the process of taking care of your skin. Hey, you big bro. I've been using their skincare products, you know, not six months. And it's done wonders for me. I'm grateful for this. It's been a six-month process. I got fat two brand new boxes. I have bought a box because I was already on a program myself. And of course, they offered me a free box because of this endorsement. But prior to that, I was buying it for myself just on a personal level. And it has become a personal part of my routine each day. It's like clockworks. I get up in the morning. I wash my face. I use the AM moisturizer. Boom. I put on the lotion. Evening. Wash my face again. Boom. Hit the PM moisturizer. So this is now... A regular part of my life it's a very simple process and i want to challenge all of you men today and you ladies who hear this message who have men in your lives this would be a good gift for them now for those of you who are new to this skincare process i suggest that you use their level one program i have a box right here boom on deck you're gonna get that in the mail let me tell you what you got in there you got your face wash you're gonna have this am moisturizer as well as pm they have a face scrub and you don't have to think about it. they got a car right here boom breaks down i mean we're talking from literally how much to use what to do in the morning what to do at night the whole process is right here super easy so with that being said at this point because teach is sponsoring today's video they're offering you an amazing deal just click the link in the description to get 30 percent off your first skincare system in a free gift Plus, as a member, you'll get 20% off for life. So I suggest to all of you men who hear this, and you ladies who have been in your lives, make the decision, click that link, get the discount, and go forward with this process. Thank you, T. Shanley, for sponsoring today's video. So as we talk about this whole teaching of, you know, really protecting what makes you attractive, what I am essentially saying is reiterating a teaching I gave some months ago. And that is, some of you know this, if you're watching me, you should know this, take notes. This is your big brother. You have to protect your progress. A part of spiritual warfare is the protection of the progress you've already made. So there are enemies that don't want you to have nothing. So the first step is to keep you from getting it in the first place. And if they can't do that, the next step is to take what you got. And the third step is to, you know, if they can't take what you got, to keep you from going further. 
So it's always a war. It, it don't stop, right? So it's either to stop you in the first place, and then once you do get to a certain door, to mess up what you got going on. And that's why you got to purge a circle. That's why you have to be careful who's around you. You have to be careful, ladies, of the man you select. Men, you have to be careful of the woman you just select to be a part of your life. So as you go forward, a part of guarding your attraction is being careful or protecting your energy. Energy is everything. Who you're around, the time you spend in meditation, that's important. I suggest you probably can do this every day, but maybe once a week, spend an hour or two and just meditate and really align your spirit, soul, and body. You know, do that. Spend time journaling. Some of you got some notes. You know, I've been busy all week. I've been working 40 hours, 50 hours. I understand that. But find some time in a week to just reflect and think about yourself. You got to put yourself first. You know, that job will go on when you, once you're gone. They won't even care. They'll replace you tomorrow if they have to. Worry about yourself. So you have to really focus on what's important. So now we have to prioritize our time in terms of what time I want to read. When do I want to go to the gym? I have to be careful about my diet. I have to be careful about the content I consume. You can't just watch this anybody. And so you have to make a decision to make good decisions day by day. That's a part of protecting the progress you've made. So let's talk a little numerology for a second. Some of you are afraid of numerology. Numerology is important. The number 50 is Jubilee, a time of celebration. So I want you to really set a goal for yourself. Give yourself 50 days to really have something you can be proud of. You got to set goals for yourself. A part of attraction and protecting that is being a task-oriented person. This is what I want to have accomplished in the next two months. So the number 50 speaks of jubilee, a release, right? A break, a breakthrough. So as you press towards that, set a goal. What, where do I want to be 50 days from today? That could be in terms of your personal life. This could be in your finances, your fitness goals. You say, you know what? 50 days, I'm going to take a professional photo to help to build my brand. In 50 days, I'm going to buy this camera. In 50 days, I'm going to get this tattoo. In 50 days, I'm going to go forward and take that class. I'm going to sign up and get that mentor. You get the point. Set a goal for yourself. Protection is about continuing to make more progress. And sometimes, as LeBron James pointed out recently in one of the interviews I heard, sometimes you got to be a little selfish. This is a season to put yourself first. If this is the season of open doors, no offense, this is the time to help everybody. This is the time to worry about yourself so that you can be in a position to really help people. You understand what I'm saying? So we're not saying to just disregard others, but put yourself first, go through those doors, work hard, discipline yourself, renew your mind, get your body in shape, do whatever is necessary for you to go forward and to be in the best possible position. And once you do that, now you are in a position where you can help others without hurting yourself. Does this make sense? Some of you right now feel kind of overwhelmed. You feel like, man, maybe I'm a little bit over my head and it's okay to feel overwhelmed, right? I've been taught, I forgot where I read this. I read this somewhere, but when your life gets harder, that means you kind of leveled up. Congratulations. You've leveled up. You went up a level. So as things or, or uh, problems in your life sometimes increase and difficulty comes, difficulty isn't always a sign that something bad is happening. We got to get this out of our minds. We've been programmed our own way. Challenge, adversity, that pressure against you is a sign you're pushing against something. You're about to go through a door, right? You're now at the gate. You're, you're past the preliminary. You are now at the gate. You're at the door. And now it's your chance to break and push in. So don't, don't, don't let the pressure get you right now. If you're feeling that pressure, embrace it. Embrace that pressure. Embrace that frustration. As those challenges come your way, stay solid. Right? Don't, don't fold. Don't let it break you. Keep your head. And, and this is why I say to meditate, to fast, to read, to reflect. Because it's going to be so crazy at times. It's, you, you know what I'm telling you. Because life gets insane for all of us. The different decisions we got to make concerning family, finances, future, the disciplines you need, trying to maintain yourself, the character, the conversation, the convictions you have in a world that's not with any of that. You have to stay on your game. And, and this is what it means to pr protect what makes you attractive. I want to take this time now to give you an insight using colors. You know, different colors have a meaning. Purple, royalty, white, purity, black. The color black, from a biblical perspective, refers to mystery. And so when things get dark around you and you can't see, don't get afraid. Embrace that. You're now entering into the unknown. 
See, every time it gets dark, you shouldn't panic. Man, I just gave somebody to realize. Now, that was actually pretty good. I don't know if you realize how good that was. I gave you something. As it gets dark around you, get excited. Now, hopefully, it doesn't mean your lights get cut off. Now, I'm going to stop playing with y'all. <laughs> you know what I mean? You, and we ain't talking about that. But as it gets difficult around you, challenges come. Start thinking deeper. Don't, don't panic. Think, hmm, I'm entering into the unknown. You, you, see, you see that perspective change? Instead of the normal response is to panic or know what's happening, stop thinking that way. Listen, listen to your big brother. Black in spiritual warfare, mystery, unknown, new territory. If you're going to something new, it's going to get dark first. <laughs> okay, that's, that's what you're going through. And so as it gets dark around you, the mysteries, the mystery comes, the unknown. This is your time to really stay focused. When it's dark, this is the time to meditate. This is the time to fast. This is the time to read, to reflect, to continue to make the decisions you made in the first place to get this far. Keep doing it, to stay consistent. And as you do this, you will be able to protect that which attracts you and that will lead to your blow up moment. That's all I have for you today. I trust this video will be of value to you. This is your big brother, King Jabez. Thanks for listening. God bless. Peace.